everyone how are you welcome back to the channel or if you're new welcome thanks for watching if you're not subscribed definitely consider subscribing and give give this video a thumbs up and hit the bell notification so that way the next time i upload a video you won't miss it so for today's video i am going to be starting off with a collection slash declutter video um i never done one of these before i've done like an eyeshadow palette collection video but i'm not going to start with eyeshadow palettes i'm going to start with like face pro like highlighters blushes and bronzers because i feel like it'll be enough for a video and i like i said i've never done one i don't know how much i'm going to declutter so i don't know if i hope like I said, I don't know. I, But I have, if you guys noticed in the past few videos or so, a little bit, that I have had a different background. I've gotten, like, these acrylic containers and organized, put them on my desk, organized them, and, like, it's in everything. And even back here, like, I've definitely really organized things. And with that being said, organizing this stuff, I've realized that there are things that I don't need don't I have too like I have too many of it and not that I've bought it and realized oh I don't like it some of this stuff is from like boxycharm and things like that so I've you know accumulated it not necessarily picking it out but I have purchased it so with that being said I'm probably gonna give it to either my friends or family or if that does, they don't want any of that, I'm probably going to sell it on like Facebook yard sale, one of those the local ones. So, anyways, I want to get started with that in just a minute. But what I am wearing on my eyes is, if you guys like it, it is from the Fairy Frolic palette. From it says Alien Cosmetics because I got this before it what became unearthly cosmetics and i'm telling you i want to get more from this brand um i used the this shade this shade crap and this shade i think oh in this shade so the greens golds and that mustardy color um so anyways that's what i have on my eyes um so let's just get started. Oh, before we actually get started, what I'm wearing today, I'm like, this is actually just a hair tie and it just says, it's upside down, it says Buffalo Strong. So, and I got a shirt also that says Buffalo Strong. I am from Buffalo and if you guys don't know what that represents, that's from basically supporting the people from the community in the area that there was the shooting in buffalo at the grocery store and i can talk about that this a little bit my boyfriend he used to be about five six years ago he used to be a manager at that store so it, it's just been a little bit hard and i can i can talk to you if you guys want to hear some things about it I can talk about it just in another video. Anyways, let's go on. I'm going to go into this these drawers and let's declutter a little bit. So I'm just going to turn you guys a little bit over. And move you up. Turn you. That should. How's that? That looks good. So we're going to. In fact, I can. Okay. Let me just move this down. Listen, I've never done a clutter video, so let's just. Yes. So I have my highlighters in these. So again, like I said, I start putting things in plastic containers also. This is from Lunar Beauty. This is, I got this in a, that mystery box, his last mystery box. It's dark kind of dark for too dark for a highlighter but i love this i do let me where's my finger um i do love this shade and that but and i am gonna keep this because i love the packaging i love lunar beauty and um 
yeah, so I'm d definitely going to keep that. Um, this, it's a Becca highlighter. Um, I know Becca's not around anymore, but I am definitely keeping this. This is so pretty, so shiny. See, definitely, definitely keeping it. Um, yeah, um, let's see. You know what, this, this is like a little sample of like that strobe cream from MAC. I got this too many years ago. So there's probably a teeny tiny bit left in it. Um, yeah, I'm going to get rid of this. I don't even know where. I, you know what? I think I got this from like an Ipsy before I even had BoxyCharm. And I've had BoxyCharm, what, two, three, two, almost three years maybe. Anyways, getting rid of this. Getting rid of that. Um... So, oh, and last thing in here is a Bare Minerals. It's probably old, too old. It's in this shade Citrine Radiance. But it's a powder and it is pretty and I like it. Yeah, I like it. So I am keeping it. Um, yeah, so that's the first little section. Okay. Next is this from Smashbox. It's the Crystal from the Hood Witch Collection. I love this. I still use it, to be honest. I just used this the other day. I like it. Look at I, I can't get rid of that. Look at that. Do you know how upset my kids would be if they got rid of this? Because this is so pretty. <laughs> yeah, my kids <laughs> love that packaging. Um, this is a little highlighter palette from Kinder Beauty. I got this in a BoxyCharm. These shades are nice. I like them. Not going to get rid of it. Um, this, listen, this is from Makeup Revolution. It's ultra, it's an ultra strong cream. I think I got this free with the purchase. I don't even, I've never used it. I've just swatched it a lot. Um, I don't know. Like, I think I'm going to keep this for now. I'm going to keep it for now. So that way I can try it out maybe. I don't know if I just put it on, I'll probably have to just put it on my fingers and swatch it. Um, let's go like that. There we go. Um, so those I'm keeping. So I get six I'm keeping so far, and I'm getting rid of one. Like I said, not gonna be a ton. Let me open this up a little bit more. Um, let's get rid of some stuff in here. Listen. All right. Ofra little mini. I got this maybe a year and a half ago. As you guys can see, I use it. This is in the shade. Rodeo Drive, classic, beautiful. We all know I'm keeping this. Um, all right, this is from Floss. Um, where did I get this? I think I got this in an Allure box. Um, I like it, clearly. I've used it a lot, and it's definitely right there. I'm, I think I'm going to keep it and try to use this up. Alright, this... Uh, I don't know. I like it. It's from Seattle, London. It is a moon dust. <laughs> Listen. Um, hang on. So... I like it. I use it. I used to use it a lot. Um, I don't know. Like, I don't want to throw it out, but I don't think anybody's going to want it. You know, like. I think I'm going to keep this a little while longer. Okay, this. I think I'm going to get rid of this. This is from Luna by Luna. This highlighter. Like. I'm not really, it's dusty, it's, 
I don't like it. I Again, I think I got this in an Ipsy before. Like I said, I had Ipsy maybe three, four years ago. So I'm getting rid of this. Okay, this is from Wander Beauty. I'm getting rid of, or no, I'm keeping this. Definitely keeping this. I actually have been using this lately. It's super pretty. Gonna swatch it. I'll swatch it for you guys. Um, yeah. So, there's that. Highlighter I'm keeping. This one, I think I'm getting rid of. This is, it's too dark for me. It's the Sophia and Mabel. If you guys remember, I was complaining about how small this was in my boxy term term video never swatched it never used it um yeah i don't like this really do not so i like i said not never swatch so i'm probably gonna just get rid of this i don't know i don't even think i could sell this it's so i could probably give it to somebody but i am definitely getting rid of that so we got rid of two things in this little container. I'm put, I've been putting them in these containers, which I kind of like how I'm doing it. Um, okay, let's see. These are like liquid highlights. Um, this, I think I'm going to keep this one. This is Laura Geller Dew Dreamer Illuminating Drops in the shade Ballerina. I'm not going to swatch them these i'm gonna keep this one i've had it for a while um this one though this milk glow glow milk from the beauty crop i'm gonna get rid of this one it's i don't like it i don't know nothing that like excites me like plus i don't use like liquid highlighters very often so Again, um, Grande Glow Plumping Liquid Highlighter. I do like this one because it does have a doe foot applicator, which I think is really cool. So I'm keeping that one. Um, let's see. Oh, this, this from Ciate. I'm trying to get all the, this stuff out. The Ciate London Dew St Dewy Stick. I'm getting rid of this. This is like garbage. I don't like it. It just makes me look oily. I'm getting rid of that. Um, oh my goodness. What am I? Okay, so I have a Tarte Shape Tape Glow one. I put this in my highlighter drawer just because I don't think it should be in a con like a concealer um drawer or anything. So put this in there. I'm gonna keep this. I don't use it too often. It's not a bad. It's not too light. It's in the shade of glow. Like I said, it is like a glowy, very glowy type of thing. Um, listen, this KVD Metal Crush highlighter, I don't know. Like, I don't know. Um, like, I think... I can keep it because, there we go. It is kind of glittery. Um, where is it? Right here. It is pretty. I'm going to keep it. And I kind of like the little applicator. You know. So I'm going to keep that. Now this is probably too old that I probably shouldn't be keeping. This is from Thrive Cosmetics. It's basically a bright, brilliant eye brightener in the shade Stella. Um, these are nice. I actually like to do this. Just in the inner corner. They're perfect inner corner. It's a perfect inner corner highlight thing. Because it's just like a like, it's just the size of a eye like an eye pencil or an eye crayon, eye crayon. So I'm going to keep that. Um, let's see. I'm going to move that over there. Um, this Too Faced highlighter. I've never actually used, used. Well, no, I've used it like once. But it came broken. Like 
off of, out of the thing. So, I don't even know if I should just throw this out, see if somebody wants it, and just tell them, hey, <laughs> I could see. Like, so I'm going to get rid of this. Definitely going to get rid of that. Um, and then I have, for more Geller, a dripping in gold highlight palette in the, it's in the triangle. I've definitely used this up. And then there's these two shades, Sunbeams and Golden Gleam. I dipped into a little bit. Champagne Toast was beautiful. I clearly used a lot of it. So I'm going to get rid of this though. And then I have, let's see, two highlighting palettes. I still have this Moon Child from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I um, highlight palette. I use it because I love this Lucky Clover shade. I do. And then there's, I think, a couple other ones that I really like. So I'm keeping this. And then I am... Keeping this, the Ace Beauté Glow Essentials Highlighter Palette, which looks like this. Definitely keeping. So, those are what I'm keeping and getting rid of for my highlighter drawer. I think I did a good job. I got rid of one, two, three, four, seven. Oh, hang on. I still have uh, a few more highlighters. But I don't put these in my highlighter drawers. I just have them on, in a separate area. I have the um, Heartbreaker highlighter palette. But I don't consider this fully a highlighter palette. I don't know what you guys think. But this, I definitely wouldn't consider a highlight palette. Um, it's a mix. Because I there's a shade in here that looks more like a blush. Or blush topper. So, and then there's a 24 karat highlight palette from Jeffree Star which is beautiful I am keep I'm keeping these keeping um so, and again my Jeffree Star stuff doesn't go in my with my all my other collections so oh that and then I have two Extreme Frosts. I have this one and the shade Gag Me. I'm not going to open these. And then I also have Stripper Magic, the green one. So I'm not going to. Okay, so let's put this stuff away. Back in here. just gonna go through this stuff in here so these are my bronzers and i have a hand this is from boxy charm um of course i'm keeping this it's not too bad it's actually very soft um i like it the my bronze and glow from natasha denona this is a little small thing um keeping that and my hula bronzer definitely keeping i haven't used this yet i don't know why Anyways, so let's, we're keeping all that. Um, keeping these two, my LYS bronzer, definitely keeping. I really like it, enjoy it. Um, I haven't used it too much, so. And then this, my Physician's Formula, the Butter Coffee Bronzer. I use this a lot. This is like my everyday one, so keeping that. This is from Makeup Revolution. It was an ultra bronze. Um, I'm getting rid of this. It's I've never opened it. It's still got the sticker on it. I've had this forever, but I am going to get rid of it, see if somebody wants it. Therefore, it's going out of my collection. This, the Complex Culture, I think I'm going to see if somebody wants this. Um, and if nobody wants it, it might end up going in a giveaway. I've never swatched it. I can show you guys what it looks like real quick. Um, but again, I've never swatched it. It's, it's pretty. It really is. It's nice. 
There you go. Um, it looks like it's got some highlighters too in it. So, more of a face palette. Um, I'm going to try and go a little bit quicker because I don't know how much my battery is going to last. Um, this, my, from LMR Cosmetics, I'm keeping that. Um, Cover FX palette. This is the a face palette. Love it. I'm keeping it. I haven't used it in a while, though. Um, this Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Glow. I'm going to get rid of this, I think. Um, yeah, I'm getting rid of that. Um, this is a Laura Geller Multitasker palette. I'm going to get... I think I'm going to keep this. Because I do like this highlighter and the blush isn't too bad. The bronzer, I think, is a little orange on me, but I like it. I'm going to keep that. Um, whew, this is going to break my heart because I want to keep this because I love this shade, but there's a cream here and I've had this for four or five years. So I'm going to get rid of this, I think. And this is probably going to go in the garbage just before because of that cream. Um, I don't like throwing makeup out, but again, that cream is so old and it's so messed up. So I'm gonna get rid of this. And this I am keeping also, this is the, from Smashbox. This is more of a face palette though. But again, I love this. It's, I'm keeping it, that's all. I'm just keeping it. So let's see, I got rid of, Let's see, what did I get rid of for bronzers? I think two, three, technically three that was in that drawer, right? Yeah. Okay, so that I'm keeping two. So there's definitely more room in here and it's like much better, much, I like it. And last but not least, we are going to be going into the blush drawer, which um, it might be a little harder for me because I love I've I've been loving on blushes lately. So, anyways, this is out from Hourglass. This is the Hourglass blush. Uh, this is pretty much my everyday one. Um, this is the Ambient Blush in Incandescent Electra. Um, I love it. Keeping it, I'm gonna try this. This is a little Too Faced Peach thing. I haven't used it. It's in the shade Apricot in the Act. I'm going to try it. Keep it. This is Bare Minerals, a blush in the shade Pink Tourmaline. This is so pretty, but it's, it's again, it's a powder. It's pretty blended up when it's blended out. I'm keeping that. Okay. <sighs> Let's see. This is going to be hard, guys. Milani blush in the shade Bella Bellini. Definitely keeping this. It's so pretty, especially if you like a shimmery blush. Um, keeping. Okay, Ciate London blush. I'm going to keep that. I don't think it goes on as dark as it looks. So I'm keeping that. This It Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores Blush. I love this. But you want to see something? I don't know why I still have it on. Um, I can't really get into that around more anymore. Um, So I'm going to get rid of this. It's going in the garbage. I've had this forever. Obviously. So get rid of that. You know what? I'm going to get rid of this. This is from Mally Beauty. It was a like highlight wand and bl blush slash cheek stick thing. And then this, oh natural from Oh Natural. This blush is so dry. Like, I don't like it. I hate it. I hate it. I don't know why it's still it's garbage. Goodbye. Um, next is my cream blushes. I think I'm going to keep all of these just because I... I've been really liking cream blushes if I'm not using my hourglass blush. But this is from 
boxy term i'm going to keep this i think definitely gonna keep this um yeah dude the, and guys this smells good too it smells like um the papaya it's in the shade papaya and it smells like papaya so i'm keeping it this this rare beauty blush these are tiny they're overpriced but I love this one. Listen, this is in the shade, what is it, Nearly new Natural. And this is so good. Like, I've heard people talk about this, these blushes, but I like them. I've heard them say that they don't like them, but I like it. Um, This is a Fenty, again, another cream blush, overly priced, but I like it. This is... Petal Poppin' from Fenty Beauty. I like it. I'm keeping it. Um, and this is a from Butanic Beauty. I haven't really tried it. I've swatched it. But I think I'm going to keep it and try it out a little long. Keep it a little longer and try it out. So those are what I'm keeping so far. And here we go. I think I'm going to keep all these two. This is actually... So it's considered a blush because it's a it's from um, Odin's Eye. I just purchased um, the newest Odin's Eye eyeshadow palette and this um, that so so main two so main two, and this is the Sunlight Love Blusher. Um, it's, like I said, it's considered a blusher, but it's definitely shimmery and I would consider this more of a highlighter that's the only thing that I was kind of disappointed I hoped I had hoped it was more of a blush than a highlighter I actually have this on today see it's right here more of a highlight um this Laura Geller um blush I love this this is the chandelier in the shade chandelier glow um it's pretty I barely used it, but I like it, so that's I'm keeping it. Like I said, I bought everything, so I'm. It's gonna be a little harder to get rid of. This is the Essence Mosaic Blush. This is one of my favorites. A lot of people, um, I've heard them not like it, but I like mine. So, again, that's why it's so hard. Like. To go by somebody's opinion. Some people like it because maybe they have more experience or more collect a bigger collections. So they have favorites, you know. Or they're just brand biased. This is a blush and bronzer. Listen, um, I think I want to keep this. I did, I believe, get rid of a sing the single blush. Um, oh, this is a blush bronzer. Yeah, it's a blush and bronzer. I think I'm going to keep this. I don't think I've ever used it, but I'm going to keep this for now. Um, maybe I'll get some use out of it. So, again, I don't, yeah, I got rid of, like, three blush. I think this is it. And this is my blush from Alamar Cosmetics. I love these little palettes. The blush, I have the blush and the bronzer one. I kind of would actually like a the highlighter one um just because they're so pretty and then i have my moon prism blush from lunar beauty i love this i barely used it yes um but they're so pretty look at that the different colors so that is what i am keeping i am not getting rid of a lot um Again, this was probably more of a collection video, not getting rid of a lot. A little bit of a declutter in here. So, out oh, my foot. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, again, I got rid of a couple things. Um, so, that is all. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, so, let's see what we just got rid of. So, for bronzers... I'm getting rid of basically three three bronzers. And let's see what I was keeping. One, two, three, four, seven, eight, nine. Get keeping nine, getting rid of three. So three twelves, one fourth. So twenty-five percent of that. I am getting rid of three things from my blush. 
and keeping four, five, six, seven, eight, 14, keeping 14 blushes or palettes. Um, I'm getting rid of three. So highlighters, I think I did the best with, um, got rid of one, two, three, four, five, got rid of five blushes. And let's see what we're keeping. Two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 16. Keeping 16, getting rid of 5. So, not too bad. Um, again, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing. And thank you for watching. And I will be doing um, probably my lip products next. Um, in the next few days. So, thank you for watching. And have a great day. Bye.